Chris Everdeen, and today I want to share with you my latest Shein haul, Halloween Costume Edition, except they're not actually Halloween costumes, they're regular pieces of clothing and accessories, but you can style them so that they resemble characters, so that they can be costumes if you want them to be, if you style them to be costumes, but they're not actually costumes edition. <laughs> anyway, this video is sponsored by Shein, so everything that I share with you in this video will be linked in the description box below, along with my special code CRYSTALEVERDEEN3, which you could use at checkout for an additional 15% off your entire purchase. And with that, let's go ahead and get started. Up first is this one strap purple maxi dress that really reminded me of Meg from Hercules. I still need to make some of the like accessories, like the gold embellishments and dark purple sash, but it's already a great dress for Meg on its own. Sure, it's not like exactly her dress, but I would say that it captures the essence of what the character wears in the movie, and I really like it. I'm hoping to find the time to, you know, make all the details that I need and take some awesome photos in this dress as Meg before Halloween time ends, so hopefully... I um, am able to do that, and if I am, I'm going to be sharing these epic photos on my Instagram, at Chris Leverdeen. Hint, hint, please follow me on Instagram and TikTok, both at Chris Leverdeen. But anywho, really pretty dress. Now next up is this really pretty baby blue puff sleeve maxi dress that I'm actually wearing right now. And I think that it makes for a great Wendy from Peter Pan dress. Like the Meg dress, I would need to add small details here and there to really make it look like Wendy because right now it just looks like a normal blue with like springtime dress. Um, but I feel like, again, this dress by itself works really well as a Wendy dress. Like if I didn't add the extra details, like the blue belt and the blue ribbon with the blue flats. Um, but if I am like dressed up in a group, people are going to know that I'm Wendy because of the light blue puff sleeve dress. Or if it's like a couple's costume and your partner is dressed up as Peter Pan, like obviously you're going to look like Wendy or like if your partner is dressed up as Tinkerbell, it's going to bring home the fact that you're dressed as Wendy. So yeah, um, again, I like this dress because you can also wear it normally and this is just a really pretty dress on its own and can also be used as a Wendy dress if you want it to. So that's really great. Okay, so for the rest of the items, you need to be like a little bit more creative in the way that you style them to really portray the fact that you're dressing like a character. This light pink tie-dye dress, I think, makes for a cute Aurora slash Sleeping Beauty dress, but obviously it looks nothing like her actual dress from the movie, but you can like add a blonde wig and a crown, and people will pretty much get the idea that you're dressed as Sleeping Beauty. A uh, pink off-the-shoulder dress, Close enough. <laughs> sure, it's more like bohemian style, but again, with the blonde wig and the crown, like they're gonna know that you're dressed as Sleeping Beauty, you know, if they're familiar with the character, which I feel like most people are. So yeah, um, this dress alone is gorgeous, and I would say that I can't wait to wear it for springtime, but honestly, I'll wear it this fall. I don't care <laughs> if pink is not in season. Neither is this 100 degree weather outside. So like I'm gonna be wearing this springtime dress in the fall because it actually feels like summer right now here in California. So yikes. But um, yes, anyway, it's a really pretty dress. Next up is this lime green dress with a sweetheart neckline and a flared skirt. And I think this one works well as a Tinkerbell dress, but like a tea party Tinkerbell dress. Like I add some lace gloves and maybe a pair of Mary Janes or white flats. And it's a pretty cute Tinkerbell inspired outfit. Of course, not exactly like Tinkerbell's actual dress again, but a, you know, inspired look for Tinkerbell. You just style the bun and the flats and, you know, the wings, if you want to add the wings to make this like an actual costume costume. And you're definitely Tinkerbell. But yes, um, now everything that I've shared with you so far has been bright and colorful because usually that's all I wear, like I love color. But since it's spooky season, I indeed did get some darker clothing for this haul. So these next three items were supposed to be part of a costume actually. And I was going to do it, but I still actually haven't decided if I'm actually going to do it or not because 
I would need to find these like really specific pieces in order to complete the costume and I don't know if I like could find them especially in time for you know before Halloween ends so we'll see but anyway I got this really cool bell sleeve long sleeve maxi dress that is really flowy and kind of fun I also got this black of oh, this pair of black knee-high boots with a chunky heel because honestly I struggle to walk in normal heels so I need them all to be chunky every time I get something healed plus I think the character also wears chunky heels so it works well and then to top everything off I also got this black lace kimono which really plays into the costume idea I don't want to reveal who the costume or who the character is what the costume is inspired by but I wonder if you can guess who I'm trying to dress as it is a little bit obscure it is a little bit niche I guess but I would be pretty impressed if you can um, think of the character that I'm dressed as or like the movie that she's from so we'll see but yeah I think that these pieces work great together and work well on their own in styling other looks so that's really cool Lastly, we have one of my favorite dresses for Halloween time, and it is this black lace-up long sleeve dress with lace detailing and a flared skirt. It's so pretty and comfortable and gives off these effortless, like, witchy vibes. And again, it's really comfortable and easy to throw on, which I appreciate because, again, it's hard to get into the spooky season when it's 100 degrees outside. So, yes, this dress has been my go-to. That is the end of the haul my friends i hope you enjoyed it if you uh, liked anything that you saw in this video today i wanted to check it out for yourself again everything is linked in the description box below along with my special code crystal everything three which you can use at checkout for an additional 15 percent off your entire purchase thank you again to shein for sponsoring this video thank you so so much for watching please give this video a big thumbs up before you go and also don't forget to click that red subscribe button if you have not already so i can see you next time bye and have a magical day. These days, under the sun together. These days, let's make them last forever. These days, these days, let's hope they last forever.